is a Yancey Studios production. Step everybody. Uh, yep, we have a seat right in the middle of the end. Oh, we got a pirate on board. We're gonna have to be careful. And we got it. Yep, just slide around a little bit there for us. Excellent. We got one hand and two hands. Please raise your hands and wave goodbye to everyone left out on the dock, guys. Wave goodbye to everybody out there. Yep, you'll see them again in two weeks. Too long. Oh, no, that's ridiculous. You're never gonna see them again. That's okay, though. You probably never saw him before, so it doesn't really matter. Now, my name is Brian. I'll be your skipper today, as well as your dance instructor and jungle guide. Now, as we enter the jungle behind me, please remember, everybody, to stay seated at all times. Also, keep all hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the boat, and we just might make it back. Now, our first destination here today is going to be the Amazon. Now, it does rain in the Amazon 365 days. That's almost an entire year. That's right. And if you look on either side of the boat, you're going to see some beautiful butterflies here today. Now, these butterflies have wingspans in their range anywhere from 12 inches all the way up to a whopping one foot. That's right. And over here we have Inspiration Falls. Now, people do ask why this is called Inspiration Falls. Well, that's because it inspires normally sensible people, such as myself, to continue on deeper and deeper into the jungle. Now, can I get an ooh from everybody? Can I get an ah? Ah, ah? Now I'm inspired. Let's continue on here today. Now as we do continue and round the bend in the river behind me, we are entering Africa. Now this is the Congo River, which is in the deepest heart of Africa. And uh, up ahead, I did set up something pretty special for you today. We are going to have a pygmy welcoming party. That's right. Should be fun. Usually some food, music, dancing. It's always a good time here with the pygmies. Um, that is not right. The pygmies never miss a party like this. Something must be wrong here. I think something scared the pygmies away today. Anybody see anything out there that might have scared away the pygmies? And, oh, the giant python. That went too much. Now, that one is 33 feet long. That is a friendly python, though. He uh, will develop a crush on you. I'm going to stop at my camp over here, grab some safe repellent and some other supplies for the uh, rest of our journey through the jungle. Oh, no. Not again. Yeah, it looks like I've got some uh, uninvited guests in my camp, and they are breaking just about everything I own. Although it uh, does look like they got my Jeep to turn over for me. Thank you for that, guys. Now I can make it home tonight. I appreciate that. Now as we move on, we are entering another river in Africa. This one is the Nile. Now the Nile is the longest river in the world. And if you want, don't believe me, you're in denial. That's right. Now up ahead on either side of the boat, you're going to see some African elephants here today, everyone. And this guy over here, I did teach him a trick. Speak. Louder. Stay. Good boy. Good boy. And we are now entering the African Belt. This is where a lot of our animal friends come to take a drink during the day. Looks like we've got some uh, wildebeest out there, some giraffes, impalas, zebras, vultures. And yes, it looks like we do have a pride of lions too. Now these lions are teaching us the first rule of the jungle. Don't be a zebra. Yeah, don't be a zebra, guys. And please don't worry about that zebra over there either. He is just sleeping. He's uh, dead tired. Now behind me, you're going to see demonstrated for you today the second rule of the jungle. It is a safari on foot. It cannot outrun a rhinoceros. It is just not going to work. Now these guys, they didn't take my advice. But I think they will get the point in the end. Go back there, fellas. Now as we continue on, everybody, please remember to keep your hands and fingers inside the boat. We are entering Crocodile Country. Now we do have a couple of friendly crocodiles here in the jungle. On the left side, that's old Smiley. On the right side is his girlfriend, Ginger. Now old Smiley there is just uh, waiting around for a handout. Now up ahead, we do have another dangerous from the river, Waterfalls. This one happens to be Schweitzer Falls. It's named for the famous explorer, Dr. Albert Falls. Boy, we're getting way too close to these falls here today. We got everybody on the side of Lena's winning. Good luck, Lena. Lean on in, everybody. Or lean out, that's fine too, guys. I know it's uh, been a little warm today. That mist probably feels nice, doesn't it? 
Now, a lot of people do ask how I landed my job as a jungle cruise skipper. I tell them it's plain to see. I took a crash course and I'm uh, just winging it. And when you've been in the jungle as long as I have, you uh, do begin to smell danger, that is. You smell danger. And it looks like we are entering another dangerous part of the river. We found ourselves a hippo pool, everybody. Now, I know these hippos might look friendly, but they're actually quite dangerous. Just last week, they sank six boats just like this one. Luckily, only five of those were mine. Just trying to get a suit here so that does not happen once again today. It looks like we're going to be able to make it out of here just in time. But uh, we are not out of the woods yet, though. We are entering headhunter territory. Now, I am going to need everybody to stay calm for me. I don't want any of you to lose your heads here today. Unlike my last crew right over there. Now, when they're dancing and playing the drums, it does mean they plan to attack. But normally, they'll attack from the right side of the boat, right up on this hill over here. Now, I don't see about that right now, so we might be able to make it through here safely yet today. Another behind us. Get down, guys. Watch your heads. Now, don't worry about the piece of tape, but I'm going to do that for you. And if you do happen to catch a spear, please remember to throw that back. We are not allowed to keep souvenirs. All right, it's like we're going to make it through. And now we do have something very special to show you today. This is something that you will only see right here on the world famous Jungle Cruise, everybody. Now can we please get a round of applause for the backside of water? As we continue on, we are entering Southeast Asia. Now, this is the Mekong River, which is in Cambodia. This is also home to the Khmer Empire. Now, up ahead, we're going to take a tour of one of the temples we have in the jungle today. Oh, well, maybe not. Looks like the uh, main entrance to the temple has been damaged by an earthquake. I do see a new entrance, though. There could be danger inside. There could be treasure. This might even be a dead end. Now, as we enter inside, guys, please remember to keep your eyes open for that treasure because uh, I might have to close mine. Testing in that area. Um, 
so you might just be able to ride one of the attractions back there, being the Little Mermaid, they have been testing that out a lot lately, so keep checking back, you just might be able to go ahead and ride that attraction before almost everybody else, because that area is not actually going to open until December 6th, but they're going to be doing testing from now until then. Now, no adventure through the jungle would be complete today without a visit to one of my oldest and dearest friends here, Trader Sam. Now, can everybody say hi to Sam for me today? Hi, Sam. Now, Sam, he is our head salesman of the jungle, and he does have a great deal for everyone on the boat here today. He's willing to trade two of his heads. That's right, guys. Two of his heads for one of yours. Any takers? No? Any way you slice it, you uh, do come out ahead. That's right. Now, as we approach the most dangerous part of our journey here today, the return to civilization. Please remember which door of the boat you came in, and you will be leaving through that very same door. That means everybody on this side, you're going to head all the way out the back. If you're in the middle or on this side, please head out the front door right over there. Now, remember as well, guys, do not cross over or in between those crates in the middle. Don't do that. That would be two bad trips today, and I am only responsible for this very first one. Now, is anybody here planning to stick around and catch the fireworks tonight? Yeah? Excellent. All right. Now, if you guys do happen to catch those fireworks, please remember to let them go. Those are hot and they do explode, guys. Yeah, those are dangerous kids. Leave those fireworks to the professionals. Now, those fireworks will be at 9 o'clock for you tonight. Don't forget, guys, 9 o'clock tonight. Now, our park is scheduled to be open until 11 o'clock today. That means we will have two presentations of the Main Street Electrical Parade for you today. The first one of those is going to be at 8 o'clock, and we will have the second one for you at 10. So don't forget, 8, 9, and 10 o'clock for all of those. Now, if you guys do want to see the parade and fireworks out on Main Street or anywhere in front of the castle, though, please remember as well, you will need to get down there early. I would say at least a half an hour before the uh, first parade starts. But really, any time after 7 o'clock tonight would probably be a good idea just to get down there and pick out a good spot for yourself so you don't miss out. Now, with our last few moments here together on the boat, I do want to thank our sponsors today. First of all, the Miracle Boat Engine Company. If your boat made it all the way around the river, it must be a miracle. I'd also like to thank the Cannibal Cafe, finding new and interesting ways to serve you. And our last sponsor here today, everybody, Animal Crackers. That's right, guys, Animal Crackers. Teaching children the world over that all animals taste the same. Delicious, that's right. Now remember to stay seated until we get to that whole complete stop here, guys. And of all the crews I've ever had here at the World Famous Jungle Cruise, you all have definitely been the most recent. That's right. Now I am terrible at saying goodbye, so I'm not going to do that today. Instead of saying goodbye, well, I'll just leave you with this. Get out. I'm sorry, that was very rude. Please, get out and enjoy the rest of your day. Hear the magic in In the faces of nature taking its course, or feel all the wonderful motion flowing through things far and near. 
Nature will share her secrets when we are ready to hear energy. These are a few of your faces flowing in timeless places, bringing our lives new graces. Energy, there is no living without you. We must keep learning about you. Now is the time to find how to energy. You make the world go round and round. You make the world go round. You make the world go round. You make the world go round. Better put these on. Hearing protectors. Because it's the Big Bang. The Piggy Bang? No, the Big Bang. The Ding Bang? The Big Bang. Oh. Now, what you're about to witness took place over billions of years. Oh, boy. Uh, better take cover. All right, universe, you clear for takeoff. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Bill? Thank you. 